Five, four, three, two, one, boom. What's up, champions? Coach Rail here with Agency 8. And in this cool training, I'm going to show you if, you if you're using Plus This SMS features, and if you're noticing that maybe your texts aren't going as fast as you want, or maybe they're not going to be in as consistent as you want, this is a really important feature. I'm going to show you how to use the Twilio feature co-pilot with your plus this feature sms texting and it will make sure that your text is get through now fast efficient consistent and you never have to worry about it again so let's check it out so this is a very important feature if you especially if you have a large contact base you're sending a lot of texts so we want to make sure that our texts are getting a delivered and we want to make sure they're getting there fast who likes fast i like fast so i'm going to show you how to do this let's just jump right in i'm going to share my screen Okay, so what happens, the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna to go to uh, plus this, and it's important that you do this in this order, okay? You wanna come in here first, and you wanna come over here, and I'm gonna to go to manage accounts. I'm gonna go over here to account integrations. I'm gonna go over here to Twilio, I'm gonna hit Twilio, manage it. And right here, this is where, this is important. If you're forwarding your text messages or allowing people to reply to them. If you're not doing that, it doesn't matter. But if you are, we wanna make sure that we've got all our numbers set up how we want them. Okay, I have 12 numbers here, and I'm gonna explain why I have 12 numbers here. Um, it makes a big difference, but I wanna make sure all the forward text messages on, forward calls is on, it's all toggled to on, just like that. This right here, just while we're here, if you wanted to have an automatic response that goes out to them, you could do that right here, just text it in there and it'll go out there. I don't personally like that, I like to respond personally right here. I'm gonna make sure I'm gonna save my settings right here. And once it's saved, we're gonna go over here, then we're gonna go back, good. Now we're gonna go over to our Twilio account. Okay, I'm gonna move me over here for a second. And we come into our Twilio, we log in, and underneath the Twilio logo, right down here, one, two, three, third one down, we're gonna click this. And then right here, the first one up, programmable SMS, we're going to click this, right here, okay? Now, while we're waiting for that, so as I mentioned, I got 12 numbers. Why do I have 12 numbers? You don't have to have 12 numbers, but here's why I have 12 numbers. Okay, Twilio sends a text at one second per text. So if you're sending out a thousand texts, it's going to take a thousand seconds. So when we use the equation where we're the quickest, the quickest from the, the highest volume, right? We want the quickest times the highest volume. So for example, I got 12 numbers, you can imagine, right? that you're gonna divide that 12 by 1,000, so it's gonna go up that much faster, right? And so that's why I have 12 numbers. So you decide which, how many uh, numbers you wanna have. That's $1 a month, it's not a lot of money, but you don't have to go crazy with it. So I just wanted to explain that. And it also does a couple cool other features is the reason I have 12 numbers, which I'll show you in a second. So let's just jump back in here, okay. So we're coming back over here. So inside of here, I'm gonna click this SMS right here, right? Under programmable SMS, we came here. I'm gonna hit SMS right here. And this is where we can create the co-pilot, okay? They also call it messaging services. And this is a co-pilot. I click this red button, create right here. I need to name it. You wanna name it, I'm gonna call it uh, the real deal co-pilot, okay? You have to select a reason you're doing this. Twilio wants to know why. By default, the most common thing, just pick mixed. You're good to go, mixed. You hit create right there, okay? So over here, see that's named, I got my thing. Now, most of these are all checked off by default, and I recommend just go with the defaults, because here's why. Let me tell you some really cool features it does. So the number one cool feature that it does, so I got 12 numbers. So I send a mass text out to my thousand contacts the very first time, the very first time I do it. And let's just say um, champion A gets the number number one and champion B gets the number three number that I have and champion C gets the number 12 number that I have. 
from this point on forever, whenever I send a text, that person, champion A, is always going to get it from the same number. Champion B will always get it from the same number and champion C, so they recognize it. Very, very cool. The other thing that's really cool is that if you live in, say, I've got people in Arizona, i got people in California, i got people in Connecticut, you know, I know people in Alabama. So what I did, and I'll show you this really quick, I went over to my Infusionsoft account. Um, I came in here, right here. I just went to contacts. I went to create a search. I searched, um, let's just say my current customers. Hold on, pop it right there. Customers. Customers, right? I'm going to click on it. And for privacy reasons, I'm not going to click on this, but you know what? I click this green button. It's going to pull out all my current customers. And what I did, I just quickly went through and I paid attention to, you know, what numbers that I had a lot of, what area codes that I had a lot of. And then I went and bought those, those area codes because what's cool is when I send that mass text, right? So when I send that mass text, if you live in that area code, it's automatically going to pick your area code. So if you live in Arizona, I've got 602 and I got 480. So it'll send you a, one of those numbers. You're going to get a message from that so it's recognizable for your area. So those are two cool features that it does for you. So just I recommend that you just leave the um, recommendations that they have. Okay, so next we're going to come down to here. We're going to hit numbers. We're going to click numbers right here and we're going to get to add an existing number. So we're going to have this red button. We're going to click it right here. And then see all my numbers are here. I've got them on two pages, so I got to do one page at a time. I click here, add selected, and bada bing bada boom, they're all there, see, and it tells you right there. It's going to show you something really quick. So now I got one more number over there. So I'm going to add an existing number back over here. And we know that I'm going to go to my next page right here. And see right there, it says plus this. What I want you to watch is I want you to see this really quickly. See this here? The real deal co-pilot. So we want to make sure that it has it. Remember how I said we needed to go to plus this first to do that first. If you don't do that, and you do this first, it's going to unhook un, un, um, everything that you did and plus this, and the way you know that, it won't say that here. So that's a good way to collect. But just keep it simple. Just do the forwarding and the reply first, then come into Twilio and do this. So I need to add that second number right there, or the last number, if you will. I'm gonna come in here, I'm gonna check it, add selected. And we are good to go in terms of this right here. So we're going to jump back over to plus this, and I'm going to show you how this works, okay? So right here, what we're going to do right here, I'm going to return to my dashboard right here. So we want to come in here. We want to create a text. I'm going to go to my campaign toolkit right here. I'm going to type in SMS. I'm going to use this. I'm going to use the SMS message right now. You can do it with your, you know, sequence, whichever one you want to use. And when we come in here, what's cool about this right here is we're going to come in here. I, I always use this. It's phone number right here. Let me pick a phone number. We're not using that. We're going to pick, let me pick a co-pilot. There it is, my real deal co-pilot. I come in here. I always go first name right here. Boom. I'm going to give the message whatever the message is. And a couple things, really good rule of thumb right here. Good thing to do right here is you want to come in here, good compliance, take this right here, copy, and you want to put it at the end of your message, okay? So they have an option to opt out right there. Right there, and here's what you want to do. Just come in here, we're going to name it, test, right here, save, and now that is how you do it, champions. So now that message, I'm going to send it out to all my contacts, and the Twilio Copilot is automatically going to decide who's going to get what number for the very first time moving forward. That will always be their number. And then, you know, it also will pick their area codes. Really, really cool function, champions, to help make sure that your texts get through and they get through on a timely matter. In fact, that they get through 
fast. So I hope that helps, guys. Once again, it's Coach Real with the Agency 8. You know, I'll believe in you too. You believe in yourself. Make the rest of the day the best of the day. God bless. There it is, guys. Oh. I hope that helps, guys. So if you want to get more tips like that, go to www plusthisexpert.com. Once again, my name is Coach Rail. I'm one of the coaches at Agency 8, and we're here to serve you. I'll believe in you till you believe in yourself. Make the rest of the day the best of the day. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for a lot of more helpful tips like this. Take care. God bless.